Hi, welcome back. Welcome. Thanks for joining us today. Well, thanks for joining me. <laughs> I hope everyone's doing well. I hope you're tackling those goals and the goals are not fighting you. You are just getting them done, accomplishing them one at a time. All right. I want to hear from more of you, but thank you so much for those who commented and shared and encouraged me. Thank you for your support. Thank you so much. Really do appreciate it. Okay. So first timers, please, please feel free to subscribe. So when something comes up new, you can get it too. Okay. We're talking about goal setting. I'm Andrea Eccles. And today some quotes came across my way and I thought I would share some of them with you because they some of them were very inspiring and left you with some food for thought and also real uplifting so I thought they would do the same for you maybe you can pick out your favorite one or two and share them in the comments share which ones definitely hit home for you okay so the first one is by author but author Lara Laura Annabelle and she wrote if the plan doesn't work change the plan not the goal if the plan doesn't work change the plan not the goal the second one is if you want to be happy set a goal that commands your thoughts liberates your energy and is Inspires your hopes. If you want to be happy, set a goal that commands your thoughts, liberates your energy, and inspires your hopes. And that one, as we know it, was by Andrew Carnegie. The third goal, sorry, yes, the third quote is a goal without a plan is just a wish or a dream. A goal without a plan is just a wish or a dream. And that one was by an Antoine de Saint Exupéry. Exupéry. Number four, if you aim for nothing, you will hit it every time. <laughs> I thought that was simple and cute. If you aim for nothing, you will hit it every time. Isn't that the truth? That was written by a motivational speaker and author, Zig Ziglar. Don't know if you ever heard of him. I never did. Okay. And this one is written by Lara Cassie. The G in goal is grow what matters. O one step a at a time l little by little your s is steps will add up so it spells out goal grow what matters one step at a time little by little and your steps will add up that's so true number six set your goals high enough to inspire you and low enough to encourage you. Set your goals high enough to inspire you and low enough to encourage you. Yeah, the author for that one was unknown. So if you know of the author, let me know. <laughs> Okay, and number seven is setting goals is the first step in turning the invisible into the visible. Setting goals is the first step to turning the invisible into the visible. And that one was written by Anthony Robbins. Eight, bad days, pray. Good days, pray. Every day, pray. And that one was by Monica Woodruff. Okay, 
bad days pray, good days pray, every day you should pray. Nine, it's better to try to, sorry, it's better to try and fail than fail to try. It's better to try and fail than fail to try. And that appeared in a poem by William F. O. O'Brien. And number 10, if your goals are too easy to achieve, they definitely aren't big enough, right? If your goals are too easy to achieve, they aren't big enough. And that author was also unknown. There's a bonus I have for you that I found last moment, so I'll share that one too. If you don't make the time to work on creating the life that you want, you're going to spend a lot of time dealing with a life you don't want. Again, if you don't make the time to work on creating the life that you want, you're going to spend a lot of time dealing with a life you don't want. And that one was by Kevin Ngo, NGO. Kevin Nicole. All right, so those were some quotes that I picked out to share for for you and with you. So I hope that you can choose one or two that registered to you and you know did something for you. You can find some food in there, some nutrients that can uplift you. And I hope that your goal setting and your goal achieving and accomplishments is going well please don't hesitate to share i love to hear from you okay so i'm andrea eccles until next time do take care